Electrosil here. Uh, it's Wednesday, the 24th day of August 2011. It's 1048 in the in the morning. And uh, background radiation, we just had a good downpour. Background radiation is close to 100, which is about twice normal. Uh, I wiped the first panel, the panel I always wipe, um, and something weird happened. Um, the hot spot was testing over a thousand counts per minute, which usually means that the rain's quite radioactive. And when I test the um, the wipe from panel number one, the one that always gets washed, uh, that's the times one scale, so times ten, um, the radioactivity is actually fairly low, considering that I was getting a thousand on the hot spot. Uh, it's about three thousand. Actually, I was testing a little lower than that before. It was around. 2000. It actually increased in the last two, three minutes. But anyways, it's somewhere around there. And then I decided to wash another panel that doesn't get regularly washed. And same air surface area, but this one was testing 10,000. See, now we are pegging the needles on the time 10 scale, so now I'm times 100 scale. So I would say this is 10,000 counts per minute. Or 10 milli Renkins per hour. I must have decayed a bit, and I'm not holding it the same way. But anyways, this was hitting 10,000, 10,500. It's always like that when you want to show something to people, okay? <laughs> it never works the same. So anyways, there's variability um, in how the panels collect. And if you look, on this, I don't know if the camera can show it, this one is very splotchy and had like little droplets of oil on it, and so did the other ones. So it looks like, uh, I don't know, there was oil um, in the atmosphere. Maybe an airplane jettisoned some fuel or something. So maybe this is why the cleaner panel, the... the the radionuclides just didn't stick to it as much as uh, the more dirty panel. Uh, so it, it, the, the surface seems to be affected by little droplets of oil in its ability to collect uh, radioactivity. But anyways, today uh, the rain is 10,500 counts per minute. Or uh, quoted in Renkins, that would be uh, 10 milli Renkins per hour. That's it for now.